question four. So, uh, did a greater total number of people visit in 2009 or 2010? So we've just got to add up these two columns. So 2009 we get 781, 2010 773. So did a greater p number of people visit in 2009? Yes, they did. Okay, so 781 visits in 2009, 773 visits in 2010. Now, part B, this bus timetable. Um, remember how a timetable works. Here we go, going down from Taunton to Coombe Flory to Watchit and so on. So this is the first bus, okay? This is the second bus, the third bus, the fourth bus and columns. So if you take this bus, for example, it leaves Taunton at 7.20, gets to Coombe Flory at 7.40 and so on, okay? So we're told a bus leaves Taunton at 8.42. So let's have a look at Taunton. Which bus leaves at 8.42? Well, it's this column here. Now, what time should this bus get to Dunster? Well, there you go. It's getting to Dunster at 9.36. Right, part two. How many minutes should this bus take to get from Taunton to Dunster? So we've got to go from 8.42 to 9.36. I would suggest you break this down into two bits. So first of all, just go from 8.42 until uh, o'clock, so 9 o'clock. So that's um, when we get to 60 minutes, so that's another 18 minutes to get to 9 o'clock. And then from 9 o'clock to 9.36, well it's obviously 36 minutes. 18 at 36 minutes is 54 minutes. Now, part C. Anne lives in Watchet. She is going to go to Dunster by bus. She wants to arrive in Dunster by 10 o'clock. So, let's see what time all these buses get into Dunster. We've got to be there by 10 o'clock. So, this will be too late. This will be us getting in at 10.36. So, we've got to be catching this bus, which gets into Dunster at 9.36. What time does that leave Watch It? Well, it leaves Watch It at 